Hi, this is Darman. Welcome to another Minecraft Let's Play video. In this video series, I'm showing you how to build Stampy's Lovely World. And in the last video, uh, we continued work on the school here. We did the playground. Whee! And uh, we did the uh, first floor uh, swimming pool uh, room for at Squacy. And the uh, combat with Stampy room uh, is complete. So we are going to head upstairs and start working on the upstairs and I did mention in the last video that um, we do need to work on the school bell that rings up here uh, and that is exactly what we're going to do uh, but not at this very second so uh, we're going to start with um, Amy Lee's room here and we're going to just uh, let's see the doorway goes on the third what's it right in the middle here should be two yeah right in the middle here uh, so there should be two here two blocks here and two blocks uh, there and uh, the other doorway by the way is going to be exactly across from it there. So uh, Let's uh, let's see. Oh, let's start with the ceiling. The ceiling in Amy's room is unique uh, in that it is uh, Pink wool. So we're just gonna put pink wool right across the top here. We're gonna make sure we leave uh, one row of red uh, wool below that and I'll we'll just finish this off here We're making some nice flooring for up there when we do our our redstone, yeah. Redstone alert! Redstone alert! Redstone alert! Yep, that alarm. I, I don't know why the alarm didn't go off when I mentioned it while we were out there, but that's the alarm, and there it is. So, uh, torches again in here, same place as the other two rooms, right against the wall that does not have the um, windows, which makes uh, makes good sense. Uh, now on the back wall here, and I, you know that is to say, when you come through the door which we don't have yet. Uh, oh, speaking of which, this, uh, this should be this should be snow here. Oh gosh, where does snow these days? What do I need? I don't need the pink wool anymore. I don't need that. I'll replace that there. And uh, might as well do that here while, while I'm thinking of it. Uh, okay, so uh, along the back wall, we're gonna put a row of oak planks. And on top of that, we're gonna put uh, some flower pots. And uh, so, in each one, we're going to, let's see, from left to right, it's going to be, okay, this is oak, sapling, birch, birch, sapling, spruce, sapling, uh, we get the yellow flower, the rose, the cactus, red mushroom, and uh, brown mushroom, there we go, so that's in there, uh, so let's get rid of that, we're going to need some uh, dirt with we're gonna need oh, where am I? I'm on the wrong one okay uh, some wooden trap doors chests and where's my fence here we go and see so we're gonna need some seating right no we don't need seating in here um, yep that'll do it for now uh, okay so the dirt blocks uh, we're just gonna go one block away from here and one block away from the wall and then same thing over here uh, so it's going to leave two blocks in the middle here which you're going to need because otherwise you're not going to you know you can't put um what do you call them trap doors you know you can't put one in this to occupy the same block uh as that one so we're just going to put these all around uh there we go do, do, do. never know the best way to do these go across and then shut them i think it doesn't really matter if they're attached at the top or bottom it's all the same uh, since we're not really using them as trap doors obviously and so uh, there we go okay um, well okay so now the only thing we really have to do on this room is some signs um, let's see grab my signs and they're gonna be of course right here uh, one two three four and then these are gonna be here so of course Step one, step two. Boy, never have I wanted a copy-paste possibility within Minecraft before. Uh, step two, so then step three, and test. So, uh, step one is going to be, and am I going to bump into this thing a little bit? Okay, that's all right. I'll just do this from up here. Step one is plant seeds, and again, all these signs have periods on the end, and only the first word is going to be capitalized. Step two, place flowers. There I am getting stuck here. Step three, water plants, piece of cake, and of course the test, flower arranging. There we go. All right, that is Amy Lee's room. Uh, oh, no, we're not quite done. We've got a chest over here in the corner. 
uh, that sits for some reason on top of a little fence and goes right here and inside it when we go inside we've got uh, three uh, three yellow flowers eight red ones eleven um, brown mushrooms 16 red ones 21 cactus and way over here we've got 12 flower pots and of course we got three uh, water buckets here eight wooden trap doors uh, nine weed seeds six melon seeds a bucket two hose there two hose there and a bucket of water and 25 in the bone meal so there we go that is what was in there when stampy opened it for his uh, school day so we're gonna need some uh, door here and one final sign to finish up this room and we'll move on to uh, Lee's room all right so we need this door there and of course the sign's gonna read gardening with Amy Lee there we go all right okay last room and then we're gonna tackle the redstone up there that'll be the last thing we do here all right so in here and uh, since I got the door here I might as well just put this on here and we're gonna put the sign up right to the left of the door and it's gonna say baking with Lee Bear all right so let's go in here and start this up so along the back wall uh, we're gonna put a row of gray wool here and then we're grow a row over here and uh, oh we didn't put the ceiling in you know let's put the ceiling in nah I just, I just, those words left my mouth I was like I don't have the snow on me why do I want to mess up all right well I don't need the gray wool anymore so let's just do the ceiling real quick here same place as the other one except it's uh, a little bit less pink than uh, than the last one um, just to do, do put these across here and then we've got several pieces to put we're gonna you know take some chunks out of the um, gray wool that we just put down there we're gonna put down uh, some items including and starting with let's see over here uh, well let's see first let before we do anything right let's put in the uh, there's these iron uh, bars that's kind of going all the way across into the corner around and that one goes uh, down to there and also a piece that goes in that corner so each corner gets uh, one little piece that's coming down here so all right, first one, let's see, crafting table. On the third one, one, two, three, we're going to pull that one out, put a crafting table there. Uh, next to that, there's nothing. Next to that, we're going to put in a, where is it, cauldron. And we'll fill it up with water in just a second. Uh, and let's see, over here in this corner right here, we're going to put a, a uh, redstone lantern. And then we're going to put another crafting table next to that and a furnace not there but right oops not there either right there uh, in the middle of those two and uh let's see so we can get rid of this stuff and we just need hmm some redstone oh, let's see we need a wood button we need uh both pressure plates we're gonna need a lever and let me grab my torches back here uh, okay, so let's see on this side is a stone pressure plate that goes here There's a wooden pressure plate here And let's see there's a uh, Lever it goes right on front of this for some additional lighting in that corner uh, speaking of lighting the lighting goes uh, Here above this window since we can't put it in the corner over here. That's the same where it would normally go then just over here it's as close to the corner as you can as you can get there so there's only three torches uh, in here but they have this glowstone uh, redstone lamp that is that uh, that does the job uh, so we just need a little water for this sink uh, you know for the, this cauldron that goes in there and oh we need a button there's a button I had got it out what did I do that no nope, here it is a uh, wooden button uh, that goes right here for seemingly no particular reason now oh we need a chest Mm -hmm. And that's going to sit right on top of this thing that has absolutely nothing. And inside the chest are these things. We've got uh, one. Let's see. What do we got here? Uh, we've got some melon seed. One one thing of melon seeds. We've got 36 wheat, uh, 37 sugar, two bucks of milk over here. Uh, next one, we've got two sugars, uh, three wheat, uh, an egg, milk, three bread egg three wheat and two sugar 
and then we've got three milks here 12 raw chickens space here uh, 11 pumpkins and three milk that was what was in there when uh, he started cooking with Lee uh, that fateful day so there we go uh, so now we just need some seating in here uh, so let's grab some oak stairs and of course we're gonna have some signs to do that uh, we're gonna need signs anyway so the seating here uh, there's two rows of seating uh, the last of which goes one row away from this uh, window and each one of these is three long and then we're going to skip a row here and we're going to put them there and of course there's going to be uh, whoops <laughs> of course we're going to throw signs at them uh, we're just going to put signs on the end of each one to give a little look of the armrest there we go and uh, so then the rest is okay so now we just have to uh, put up the signs here um, now let me see here oh this oh dear I put the torch in the wrong spot let me grab my torches again this torch actually goes on the, for reasons which are obviously, um, this one can't have anything there because we only have room for four signs here. This one actually goes down there on the floor. Uh, oh, well, it's on the wall, but it's down at the floor level there. So, uh, all right, so then we just need our step one, step two, step three, and test. Okay, so then that means step one is cook meat, pie, and cookies. Uh, again, the period at the end there. Uh, step number two, sample food, which I think is where Stampy just absolutely excelled at. That was, that was really he shined pretty well in here. You know how to do everything, but sampling the food I think was his, is definitely his favorite part there. Uh, step three, create new meal, and lastly the test was the bake cake race, which I can't get down there. Okay, uh. oh this thing is in the way there. Uh, BK Grace. Okay, all right. So that is uh, this room complete, and uh, which of course means I probably missed something. So let me know if I missed something in there. Uh, do we put the sign out here? Yeah, we did the sign out here. Okay, so now we come to the part where you're either going to tune out or be very vigilantly focused on uh, what I'm about to tell you. So we've got this lever, and it operates mysterious things which we have no idea really what's up there based on the videos. So I am going to show you uh, a very reliable method for making this work. And yeah, this method, uh, this is not what he did. And the reason I know for sure that he didn't do it this way, oops, this has to go sideways, right in the middle there, um, is that when he flicks this switch, you can hear, you can hear a, what do you call it, um, piston moving. And it's obviously some sort of switch up there, some sort of, that's going on up there uh, at first maybe I thought he might be doing some little stuff with the minecart um, I don't know but um, I don't know I'm not 100% sure again <laughs> I did not go in school for some reason when I was in Stampy's world so uh, and I'm going to how am I gonna do this I'm gonna go I'm gonna go outside which actually is good because I have to put I missed a torch I missed a torch down here Oh, and speaking of, whoa, we didn't even do the torches up here. Hold on. The torches in the hallway uh, are right next to this thing. And then they are, if you go even as far over to this wall as you can, uh, just put one right up on top and then one uh, opposite it there. And then downstairs, we already have this one up here uh, from the last video, and there should be one right in the middle there. That's going to give us a nice amount of illumination there. Let's close up these doors and make this little neater down here uh, let's see so outside I'm gonna fly up here and I'm gonna do what I did in the last video which is just to sort of you know knock out a couple of things here uh, this will make it a little easier to get some light in there and to be able to see what we're doing let me just add some illumination up here and that's a block we don't need that we accidentally we that I accidentally put up there and just, this is not official here okay so uh, the reason I did that is just so that I can easily flick this switch, which I'm going to have to break this glass temporarily. Now I can flick this switch and show you what we're going to do uh, up here. So, since we don't know exactly what he did up here, and if I ever find out, I'll, I'll definitely show you what he did. Uh, but this is going to work absolutely perfectly. It's going to create the right notes. It's going to create the exact right timing of the notes. So, you know, this is, in effect, going to create the correct bong. You just want to hear the chunk of the uh, of the piston up here. So, 
Uh, let's leave all that in there. So right above here, right above this block, should be the, um, oh, yes, the redstone, uh, the lever, which already is flicked into the position that needs to be to power everything. Uh, when he comes up here, it's in this position. Uh, then he comes up and flicks it to the left, which is to left of when you're standing in the hallway. That is not to our right right now, obviously. Uh, so what we can easily do is start with this redstone blob and we're going to put, oh, you know what, I need a um, just kind of a random block to uh, to build some things with. Uh, I'm going to do, I'm trying, to get in, trying to get in here, eh, let me in. There we go. All right, so to the right of this, now that we're inside here, uh, we're going to put a block here and a redstone torch on the side of it like that. Uh, and that turns that redstone torch off. Uh, and that's fine. And then we're going to take a lock, just one line of redstone out to the left of that, uh, where that was seemingly empty, but it's actually basically occupied by that uh, redstone torch. So we're going to put one more block right here. And there's going to be another redstone torch on this side of it. So basically, what I should give you a preview we're going to make a looping system. And then we're going to put the note blocks like over here, basically, is what we're going to do. So, and, and the looping system works great, uh, except that it's um, it's always on and running unless you have um, you know, a reverse, you know, the, uh, something to reverse the that initial uh, redstone torch, which is what we we're doing here. So, uh, in other words, when we when this alarm is off in this position, uh, the the this is going to be off here. This is the, the part that really matters. Uh, so we're going to leave it like that just to uh, keep this thing straight. Uh, so when we're staring at the this redstone torch, we're going to turn to the left and we're going to put a redstone repeater here. We have to be facing this direction. Don't You can't put anything there. And then we're going to turn around and put another one facing the same block. And then we're going to connect them with two pieces of redstone. You can see them connect up. So what happens is the electricity is going to come out of here, go around here, and go back into this block, and it's just going to keep uh, feeding the loop. And we're going to take all, both of these, and we're going to stretch them out to the third position uh, to create a, a, the right amount of delay that we need. So well, what's happening now, and, that, and this is going to kind of just kind of head out this direction right now. So let's test it out right now what we have. I think I said right now a lot in the past few seconds. So now, as you can see, this is now power. This got powered up, and it is now sending a pulsing signal, which we've done these in the past. Uh, and this is a, just a nice, neat little compact way to, to loop something. And it's very. It can be. This is this is about as compact as it can be. Uh, you can stretch these out, make more delays if this is not enough, but it it, it will be enough of a delay. So we're going to have this. Uh, well, let let's just shut this off for now. So. A little bit annoying, and uh, let's get back up here. This looks like a number six in here. I keep thinking of Big Hero Six. What a great movie! Anyway, uh, so then we have to just uh, put up here. We're gonna put. Oh, we're gonna put note blocks, but we have to have two spaces in between them to create a little bit of a delay. And uh, we'll, we'll deal with that in just a second. And we need to come out here, feed the redstone in, and we have to come out that extra block because if we don't, uh, it just ends up going near it. It doesn't go that line needs to go right into that block uh, we could do it here I guess and that, that would work too um, if we were pressed for space but we're not so we got, we got plenty of space up here uh, and then so that redstone is going to pump into here periodically and then we're just going to put two uh, redstone repeaters heading in this direction uh, this one is going to be on the third position this one is in the second position and so now we just have to tune these drums uh, no, drums. We have to tune these to the proper notes. So to do that, what we have to do is tune these. Uh, we're, we're in creative mode, so we can only tune. We can't play. If we click on the right button, we will destroy the block. So we don't want to do that. So the first note is the higher note. The second note is the lower note. So we're going to do the higher note. Uh, and all you have to do is just click the left trigger if you're playing on Xbox or you want to go the 11th note. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. And then the next one is just going to go to the fifth note. One, two, three, four, five. And there we go.
that's it that should do it now uh, we've got the delays already built in and it's this and it's that okay so this should be good to go that should be it it's not that horrible is it just a little loop here and the loop feeds these two blocks with a delay in between the two and uh, this is kind of a yucky part over here with the uh, blob of redstone there the block with the redstone torch on it and then we got this little red there and uh, this block here with this redstone that creates this is the loop here where it goes around and around and that feeds the two note blocks and uh, so we got plenty of room up here to do that uh, so let's let's give it a whirl here all right there we go it's, oh, I can't get in there there we go yep and you can hear this thing pretty well um, yep and the loop is just working away and you can see this is flashing intermittently and this is going bing boom bing boom and I worked it out that's that's that seems to be the right timing for the two notes uh, and even if it's not 100 mill, mill, millimeter perfect it's uh, it's really really good so uh, with that I'm gonna shut this silly alarm off uh, I'm gonna replace this red wool which I ripped out of existence and I'm gonna need my uh, some glass here to replace got to make the repairs it's always messy the big jobs you always have to destroy things uh, before it starts looking better okay then we'll just put one middle one in there okay all right so oh boy uh, did I mention that I, did, I changed this over to wall I did did I, I don't know if I mentioned that so it's, I changed that over the wall I confirmed that uh, in the video and okay did I miss anything all right the outside looks good got flag bell once and do, do thinking there uh, we've got combat with stampy we've got both torches we've got a pool um, back door we've got play area we've got stampy's combat area trick down we've got upstairs now we've got a school bell <laughs> we've got a school let's just hear it from in here you can hear it the sounds might be a little quiet but I'm not sure what you're hearing but okay anyway turn that back off we got gardening with Amy Lee looking good up here and bacon with Lee bear all right I think that's it we are done school and uh, this is good just in time though because uh, a lot of kids in our area are getting ready to go back to school Real whoa what is this doing in here <laughs> you probably saw me plant that and didn't even I didn't even know it myself. Yeah, a lot of the schools are going, getting ready to go back into uh, session here uh, at the end of August. And uh, so, yeah, it's pretty appropriate that I built the school ready for, well, the dogs, I guess, is really the only people that are uh, going into the school. So I guess I'm just going to stand here in front and uh, say, I'm Darwin68. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye.